Hello everybody, welcome back to another Blender tutorial. Today we will be making a hairball, um, like the one you see on screen. It doesn't have to be a ball, it can be any shape, but that's the one that we're going to be making. So I hope you enjoy, and let's get right into it. Go ahead and open Blender, and get a new file, select everything, delete it, and then add in your UV sphere. Um, I'm just going to add a subdivision surface modifier to it to give it some more topology to make it look smoother. And then I'm going to go to the particle properties tab here, add a new particle setting, click here, and as you can see that adds some here. Now this is too long, so let's strengthen this down a little bit uh, until we get something that we're happy with. So this is pretty good. Go ahead and click advanced. And all these things don't really matter except children and rotation. So let's tick the rotation and randomize that a little bit. Now uh, from none to interpolated, and this makes it a lot thicker, as you can see already. Now let's turn this up a little bit uh, until we're happy with that. That went back down to zero. Don't do that. So that that's okay. Now what you want to do is go on to clumping and turn this up, not too much, just a little bit, and change the shape to whatever you want, whatever looks good really. Okay, now you can play around with the randomize, and now let's go into the roughness and change the uniform. Now this is the thing that makes it look good. Um, it basically just gives a random, I don't know, shape to it. It looks a lot better with that. So we're basically done that. Uh, just play around with some of the settings until you, you're happy with what you have. Um, I'll be back when I've got that. Okay, so now I've changed some of the settings, just the things that I went over, and we've got this. Let's go into our shading tab, and we can add a texture. So for our texture, we're just going to have something very simple, just a color uh, a brown color, a bit like this. Right, that looks good. Now we're going to set up our camera. Go ahead and add in your camera, move that, and go into it, change it so that it locks your camera to the view, and focus on that. Okay, now get to what point you think looks good. Okay, and I'm just going to add in a HDRI from HDRI Haven. Okay, I've got my HDRI. Let's move it so it looks good in the shot. Something like this. Alright, now change our rendering engine to the only one that matters. And we should be done. If you want to add in a sun, you can. Uh, you can do whatever to this scene. Um, let's go ahead and render it, and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so we have the final product here. Um, I think it looks pretty good. Uh, we could have added a denoiser to get it less noisy. Um, you guys can do that if you want. Thank you for watching and making it to the end. If you did, please comment uh, the numbers 84, and I will give your comment a heart. Um, but apart from that, thank you for watching my video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.